everyone and welcome to a new 3D Paint tutorial. Today let's see what's new with 3D Paint and Kisha 2023 to make your workflow easier. Some of the latest improvements are that a brush indicator is now correctly projected onto the object you are painting on. This gives you a much better sense of control over your brush. Also, the set brush angle is displayed correctly in the brush settings so that you know exactly how the brush stroke will appear when applied to the object. Setting the follow path option is also particularly helpful. With this setting, your selected texture will follow your painted brush stroke. For example, you can use it to stretch out scratch textures or have arrows follow your brush stroke accurately if you don't want too much variance. In addition, Keyshot has introduced a long-awaited feature of pressure sensitivity, which you can use if you are working with a pressure-sensitive tablet. This can be activated next to the size, opacity and flow parameters in the settings of the 3D paint texture. And you can decide which one you want to activate, as well as using pressure sensitivity on multiple parameters at once. This improves the fundamental control of your brush without needing to switch back and forth between the settings. This creates a much more comfortable and intuitive workflow, which results in more natural and realistic brush strokes on your 3D model. The new workflow feels nearly like painting on traditional media, but digitally inside of Keyshot. With the addition of pressure sensitivity, it is much more easier to have control over a wide range of inputs like color, roughness, opacity, bump, and more on different materials. And above all, it's also a fun new experience to texturize your objects in Keyshot. Have you tried 3D paint with a tablet yet? Let us know in the comments.